I'm just doing this here on uh, axes and chainsaws. I was going to get a, um, a chainsaw or electric chainsaw, but I might get an axe instead for the reason is uh, if I don't have any power, I will just manually sharpen it. So I do not know if I need that yet, depending on the ground. And here, here's a nice axe here with one of those built in. I don't know if that'll be good enough. There's another one. Looks like this would be the best. It's $30. I don't really want to carry it around through the city. Landscape axe. This one has a hammer. I don't need the hammer. Fence post or whatever. Or maybe I do need that hammer. Let me think about that. $79. That's a better deal in my opinion if that's the actual one. It's the last one too. It does make a lot of noise. So let me think about that. And there's also other Home Depots. I can pick something like that up, it's not too difficult. Garden tools. I have a small one, it's a pain in the ass. Okay, and now so uh, the chainsaws. So this, this is a chain drive extendable hole saw and trimmer. 100 Nineteen dollars. Is that electric? No, it looks like it's uh, looks like it's electric. I need it to be a hundred percent quiet, and then if it's electric, to have batteries. Which might be too much to ask for my budget. So that axe might be the best, or an axe. I like to get a bigger uh, hitting radius. You know, bigger blade on that. I'm gonna carry on that something that heavy. I might as well just get the highest impact for strike. Cordless chainsaw with the battery, so four hundred dollars. There's another one, three hundred dollars, and yet yeah, this is the cheapest one, one hundred and thirty-eight dollars. I'm going to research these a little bit and come back, I think. And again, uh, Chilliwack has been the best selection of axes and chainsaws that I've seen at Rona and Chilliwack. This is Home Depot in Vancouver. This one would be cool if it was electric. But uh, Yeah, anyway. Okay, that. Uh, try to get more gardening equipment. Here we go. Got some shovels here. Already got an old one, and also uh, the miniature versions. Pitchforks. I do not need one myself. These picks are useful for removing big rocks from the ground. I might need one. Have a miniature one. If I need one, I might go with pots if I'm doing something there. And yeah, that's about it. So I might be back for that axe. All right, take care.